So what is line weight? Well, it can generally be described by these two words, line and weight. So line generally is a graphic uh, description, whereas a weight indicates thickness. Okay, so that could describe something that is heavy. to something that is light. I know we often confuse the term dark versus light to describe line weights, but this is more of a tonal description or an expression. So in that way, this part isn't quite right, okay? What it is, is that we try to express depth with line weights. It is, since most architects uh, draw on a piece of paper, it is a two-dimensional flat piece of material. Um, we have to use some way to indicate what is foreground and what is background. Generally, when we look at real life, we have something like um, we have something like this, where we look at perspective to indicate what is closer, what is further. So, just doing that, the longer line seems to be in the foreground and the shorter line seems to be in the background. But when you're drawing something like a elevation, remember if you recall elevation is a flat view or a floor plan, which is a flat view of the described building, uh, we don't have the luxury of a perspective. So in that case, we use what is called line weight. So in that way, we have, let's see, a line which is of, let's say this is zero, 01. The next line and next line becomes heavier. And then next line heavier still. And then the next line maybe the heaviest. So even though the line itself is relatively of the same um, same length, because of the heaviness of the line, the thickness of the line, it looks like this heavier line is popping up towards you and the lighter line is receding in the background. So we have an idea of perspective and using line weights to describe what is closer to you, okay?